signs uh, for a stroke? No. You guys know the warning signs of a stroke? No. no. Okay. Do I know the warning signs of a stroke? I should know the warning signs of a stroke. I don't necessarily know the warning signs of a stroke. Uh, Have you ever heard pain in your pain in your chest? I would imagine, or something about your your head. Or something. Yeah. I, I guess it radiates really through your chest or your arm and stuff like that. So I guess those are the first signs. I would uh, imagine. Uh, do you guys know the warning signs of a stroke? Um, uh, I might. Go ahead. Uh, not able to smile. Um, yeah, I'd have severe pain. I would uh, be dizzy, nauseous. Uh, do you know any warning signs uh, to a stroke? As far as I know, there can be many signs of a stroke or heart attack, and they can look different in different people. So. Do you guys know any warning signs uh, for a stroke? Slurred uh, speech. Yep. Side smile. I can't say words. Yep. Yeah. Uh, stroke. Um, uh, aphasia, uh, which is trouble speaking, uh -huh. like doing right now. Um, <laughs> numbness, tingling, facial droop, um, blurry vision. When you smile, you have a crooked smile. Yep. You can't raise your arms. Yep. Above your head. Uh, slurred speech. Slurring speech. That is correct. Yep. And facial droop. Do you know what the acronym FAST stands for? I do. Yeah. Face, arm, speech, and time of all nine. That's one. exactly right. Yeah. It's for face, arm, speech, and time. Time yeah. is very critical to call to get a medical treatment. Uh, the quicker you get medical treatment, the more likely you can reverse the symptoms. Wow, you nailed it. Thank you, sir. You can learn the warning signs of a stroke by learning the acronym FAST. F stands for face. If you have a facial droop on one side or the other, that is a sign of a stroke. Ask the person to smile, and if it's an uneven smile, that would be an indicator of stroke. A stands for arm. Um, weakness or numbness on one side of the body, particularly the upper extremities, could be a sign of a stroke. Um, ask the person to put their arms out in front of them. If they have one drooping down, that could be a stroke. S stands for speech. If the person has slurred speech or has trouble getting their words out, this could be an indicator of a stroke. Ask them to repeat a simple sentence like, the sky is blue. If they're not able to do that, that's a symptom of a stroke. And T stands for time. It's important, vitally important, to call 911 as soon as you recognize the symptoms of a stroke in yourself or someone else. Uh, time is brain. The sooner you get to um, hospital, the faster you can be treated and potentially reverse the long-term effects of stroke.